What has life after Flash been like for me? When I first saw Flash Gordon, it changed my life. Flash! I love everything about Flash Gordon. I remember every single bit about that film. I would have been pretty little the first time I saw Flash Gordon. I love when they put the hand in the thing and the bug bit him. That frightened me as a kid. You can see why George Lucas wanted to make a Flash Gordon movie. You can see Flash Gordon's fingerprints all over Star Wars. Flash Gordon's tank top. This is a Hawkman blaster. Immediately, the Queen chorus comes right in. And I already had this thing in my head. This sort of boom, 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 boom. It is a comic strip, and therefore they are pretty uh, one-dimensional. You have to care for the character. I think I remember being quite nervous about it. It was fun. I couldn't breathe. The only comic book I saw was at uh, Dino's house. Melody, it's Dino. So we look around for one year. No star really can break Russia God. Well, you always knew when Dino was there. My advice was, you know, not to get involved in a confrontation with Dino. He lost his family. He lost his place in Hollywood. Sam is a man who struggled. Who wants to hire a, a bitter, angry actor who's blaming everybody else? And I just got up in his face. I said, stop it. Stop it. You know, all the tabloids are coming out, you know, saying, oh, where's Flash Gordon been? And we had little kids, and I said, you've got to do something else. Our weapons are usually concealed. It's harder for them to go and explore other characters because everybody just wants what they love. You know, a lot of people say, oh, you got to separate your personal life from your movie life. I don't know how you do that. They became those characters, and they were iconic to the to the world. It's much better to be typecast than to be miscast. Sam is a definitive Flash Gordon. No one could play it better. It's one of those uh, iconic roles that won't. They they stand the test of time. People dying on their deathbeds. Please say Gordon's alive. Gordon's alive. Hallelujah. <laughs> That's how we roll. Sixty-one. All right.